outside, inside. And on top of the parking garage for Loma Linda University Hospital, thousands of people packed together over the weekend for a car show during the coronavirus pandemic, violating the state's ban on mass gatherings. People here are really, really conscious. They're not from here. Ray Verona is one of many neighbors who were upset to see traffic from the gathering spilling into the street and into first responders path to the ER. You know, Loma Linda is, is a city built on health care. So it, it runs completely counter to everything that the, the city is here for and, and stands for. Assistant City Manager Conrad Bolowich says this was unacceptable, but understandable. A bunch of kids being in lockdown for six months. The event was supposed to be significantly smaller, about 10 to 20 cars driving through the parking lot for the youth ministry at Loma Linda University Church right across the street. But the city says the event flyer went viral online and the gathering quickly spiraled out of control. Loma Linda University Church has since apologized to the community online, saying in part, we have worked tirelessly with our partners in health care and government to maintain care and wisdom during this pandemic. We failed to anticipate that the event would grow so far beyond what we had planned. Law enforcement broke it up after a flood of complaints, but it took hours to clear everyone out. Most of the people here appear to be in their early 20s, and San Bernardino County reports that most coronavirus cases here, nearly 13,000 of them, are diagnosed in people between 20 and 29 years old. Would you go to, into a crowd of 3,000 people right now? No, I don't think so. I don't even go to the grocery right now. Well, lots of people who showed up to this event were wearing masks, but even so, a lot of neighbors feel like it was completely out of line with all the health care workers across the street risking their own lives to save people from this virus. Reporting in Loma Linda, Nicole Comstock, KCAL 9 News.